Hello guys, welcome back and I hope you all are doing absolutely fine. So today we will be continuing with our ongoing repertory exam revision series with our next video which is on the topic of Dr. Kishore's card repertory. Full name of the repertory is Dr. Kishore's card repertory, author Dr. Jugal Kishore. Publication year with edition. The first edition was published in the year 1959, the second edition in the year 1967 and the third edition in the year 1986. Introduction. A gigantic and a very useful card repertory was published in the year 1959 by an Indian author, Dr. Jugal Kishore. Initially, it contained 3,500 cards and 579 drugs. It was mainly based on Ken's repertory. The second edition was published in the year 1967. The edition was improved in relation to the number of cards and rubrics. It has 10,000 cards and now 600 remedies. The third edition was published in the year 1986 with a few editions here and there. The repertory has been out of print for a long time now. This repertory can be used for cases which have prominence, mentals and physicals or only particulars. Sources of repertory of Dr. Kishore include Kent's repertory, Concordance repertory, Bogus Synoptic Key, TPB, BTPB and different homeopathic journals. Advantages As compared to the other repertories, this repertory is most complete Maximum number of rubrics and also remedies facilitates for selection of proper simulium in majority of cases. As it is based on Kent's repertory, no question of reliability is there. Using this repertory, we can repertorize any case either by Dr. Kent and Bonningosen's method. Almost all rubrics in the Kent repertory are incorporated in this card repertory. Many of the rubrics in the Bonningosen's repertory are made available, up to date and complete. The rubrics and the cards are arranged in alphabetical order. Table of contents of rubrics with their code numbers is given in the index. Contents of the medicines with their code numbers are given in the index and the cross references are helpful in finding the related and similar rubrics. Disadvantage Grading of remedies have been totally neglected. Because of its big size, it is very difficult to be carried and be used and to be used by bedside. There are certain medicines in the list which are not found under any of the rubrics. Quite voluminous. Repertory include three boxes of card, a, a through knowledge of a thorough knowledge of rubrics are necessary before starting the process of repertization, which is lacking in this card repertory. So with this guys, we have covered Dr. Jugal Kishore's card repertory and again a very important answer for our papers, which is frequently asked in exams. So these are the bare minimum points which one needs to remember. You can always add more data from your textbooks, source books, lectures, class lectures and teachers. But this has, but these contains the bare minimum points and the highlight keynote points and the key note points, which one must remember before examination for revision or even before starting preparation, right? So with that, we end this video here. Thank you for listening and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Take care. And also, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. It will motivate us to make more and more such videos for you all. Thank you.